Man, no one's trying to recruit safeties like that unless you're doing these things on your highlight video. We're going to talk about it today on the Gridiron Stud Show. Hey, I'm talking to you. I'm talking to you. Recruiting advice for everyone. It's the Gridiron Stud Show. All right, the number one thing you're going to want to show on your highlight video is your athleticism. You're going to want to hit guys in the face with that right now. Show that recruiter right now that you're athletic enough to play this position. And sometimes when you're playing on the hash or in the post all day long, it's difficult for you to show that. Here's a way that you can do that. If you play offense, if you're a running back, wide receiver, or you return kicks, whether that's punt or kickoff returns, you're gonna to wanna to show that on the highlight video and you're gonna to wanna to lead your highlight video off with one of those big plays from that side of the ball or in special teams. Yes, I know you play safety, so you're gonna be tempted to show a safety play right away, but if you have a play from offense or special teams that really shows off your speed and athleticism, lead off your highlight video with that. One of the really good examples of that is a guy that we have on the Gridiron Studs app right now, Jordan Jackson. He's a guy that he gets it, all right? Safety's aren't always the highly recruited guy, all right, for the reasons that I have stated. And he led off his highlight video with this play right here that we're showing you, a kickoff return. That gets the college coach's attention right now. You have to show your athleticism. This, uh, a lot of times you will see a guy that plays offense get switched over to defense when they go and play in college. And that's because a lot of times college coaches will go and recruit guys on that side of the ball that they don't necessarily feel like will, they will be elite at that offensive position when they get to college, but they can definitely see through the athleticism and the way that they do things with the football and the, you know, the way they, their jumping ability, going to catch, playing wide receiver. They could see them translating those skills into being a really high grade safety or cornerback. And that's the reason for it. They've recruited a guy to play defense based on what they've seen offensively. So if you're a guy that's fortunate enough to play both ways or you're in the special teams game returning punts or kickoffs, go ahead and lead your highlight video off with one of those plays if it's explosive. If all you have are a bunch of routine plays offensively, then cancel what I just said. If you've got a kickoff return for a touchdown, punt return for a touchdown where you displayed some speed, where you had a long catch and run, where you had a long run as a running back, lead your highlight video off with that. Show your athleticism right off rip. You're trying to grab that coach's attention immediately. The next thing you're gonna to wanna to do is show your coverage ability. Yes, you're fast. Yes, you could jump. You've shown that. Your first play showed your athleticism, but can all that translate into you covering? If you have clips of that, if you've been able to do that in a game, you're gonna to wanna to show that rather early. If it's not the second clip, you're gonna want it somewhere within those first five clips. You're gonna to wanna to show your ability to cover. This is again, football has turned into a complete passing game. They're doing it a heck of a lot more. So you're gonna to have to show your ability to cover because as a safety, you're gonna to have to do that. Whether it's a tight end, it's a slot guy, or it's a running back out of the backfield, you're gonna to have to show that. If you have zero of that from games, Man, you might have to insert a clip in there somewhere from a camp that you might have gone to or something, a practice clip. Slide that in there. Yeah, it might look crazy. Definitely, if you have a game clip, put it in there. But if you don't have that in a game clip because you don't face those kind of offenses or you haven't been asked to do that by your defense, like I said, slip in something from a camp, from a practice that shows your ability to cover because that's becoming more and more important in this game. And you kind of give that college coach an idea of your ability to cover and get them interested in you and you're going to need to do that early in your highlight video third thing you're going to want to show is your tackling ability let's face it if you are not a guy that can tackle you're not going to be a very good safety so if this is something you really really struggle with you're going to have a hard time getting a college football scholarship offer if you do get one and you get to the next level and you don't clean that up you're probably not going to be seen on the field there's nothing worse than a safety missing a tackle back there and a guy goes 50 60 yards all right you are the last line of defense so if you are a guy that thinks he can play at the next level you definitely have clips of you making some tackles if you have some aggressive booming hits you definitely want to put those early on to show that you are a guy that's aggressive that can make tackles that can go hunt ball carriers down and you can you know it's a physical game and deliver some physicality as you run around and you're making your plays as a safety something you want to include early don't make it all of your highlight video because like i said there's these other things that you want to show but if you've got some really good hits don't save them for the end of your highlight video okay this is not some kind of feature film where you have a cliffhanger and there is a plot and then there is a climax at the end this is not what your highlight video is going to be 
everything up front your athleticism your speed your coverage ability and then also your ability to make big tackles make big hits if that's what you have but if it's just a bunch of good solid tackles then you want to include some of those there into the mix of the things that you need to show early on in your highlight video guys i can't stress this to you enough like with any position that first 30 to 60 seconds is very very important you want to show that coach everything that you can do and you better be able to tackle so if you have some of those mix those in there really early in your highlight video finally number four the last thing that's really really important on your highlight videos if you have some versatility show it already talked about you including plays from the offensive side of the ball if you have those get those in there pretty early in your highlight video if you've lined up at corner or they've asked you as a safety to go line up on the outside and cover guys out on the edge you definitely want to do that hey does your defense ask you to blitz show that also don't save it for the end i've seen guys try to put all of their plays where they made good tackles then the plays where they've had interceptions and then the plays where they blitz and that first blitz comes two three four minutes into the highlight video that's not it you've got to show early on that you have this ability to blitz so if you're coming off that edge and you have really good timing or you run into that backfield and you've been totally disruptive include a couple of those there you want to show that coach early on that you have the ability to do this so you're showing them that you have athleticism that you can cover that you can make tackles that you can blitz and any other thing that you have available to you in your toolbox you're going to display all that and that in those first 10 plays in the first 30 to 60 seconds you're going to show that so if you're a guy that can blitz or cover out on the edge cover tight ends or you got some good coverage clips you're definitely going to want to show that and make the coaches aware that you have this ability one bonus that i didn't put in there that i you know i, I know i don't need to include this if you have interceptions you're definitely going to put that in there that's going to show your ball skills that's a given guys you, you should have that as a safety but i just want to sum everything up here when you're back there at safety sometimes it's very difficult to have good film you're you know as i said back there deep 10 15 yards not a whole lot of action but you definitely feel like you're a guy that could play at the next level you've been to camps you've been up against guys in some of these off-season activities or you do really good in practice and you feel like you're a guy that can make the plays it just hasn't happened a lot in games or if it's happened in games and you're just not really knowing how to put this highlight video together i've just given you the blueprint show your athleticism find something that will capture their attention so if you've got a long run whether it's in a punt kickoff return or get on offense show that right away if you've got big hits put that in there show your coverage ability show your versatility so that means blitzes covering out on the edge it's very difficult to recruit safeties because of the kind of film that you get it's a hard position to recruit and a lot of times it's just going to include showing stuff from other aspects of your game so to get a coach to understand that you could play safety so if you want to capture their attention this is how you're going to do it follow this blueprint that i've laid out for you hey don't forget that question who's your favorite safety who's your guy out there that you really model your game after who's your idol your guy that you look up to as a safety playing this game right now also before you guys head out of here don't forget go ahead and subscribe to the channel hit the bell because we've got a bunch of content like this coming your way and the last thing is if you're a high school football player and a potential college football prospect you definitely want to download the gridiron studs app i have a link to it in the description down below go ahead and create your profile boost your recruiting we've got college football coaches from all over the country looking through the profiles right now trying to find guys that they can add to their program and their recruiting classes so i hope you guys enjoyed the video give it a like give it a share don't forget to comment and looking forward to seeing you guys next time gridiron studs be seen